get to Thursday. Your only goal for today is to wake up, get out there, and, and find have a good day. and find the mini miracle or the big miracle that God has planned for you. The miracle in my life today is Sophie making her own breakfast. She's got eggs. You having toast? Yeah, but I just, I'm not making it yet. She made her own eggs. She's making her own bacon. Amazing. I don't and know she's controlling the beast. How is this happening, Sophie? Tell me, what are you doing? I got her in trouble one like good time, and then she was like, oh, okay, I need to listen now, and she's being really good. That's amazing. It's amazing. Sophie has a leash on her, and it's decided that this puppy will shadow her until she is completely potty trained. She and is it, getting better until she knows her name. She does know her name. I believe it. I just think she's not. Ah, don't you even come to me. Sit. Good girl. There comes a time in every puppy's life where they have to learn to behave and today is the day. Now hopefully it's not just a one day thing. Hopefully she sticks with it. So in honor of getting ready for Christmas, I've taken all the cushion covers off the couch and they are all in the wash. We are going to wash all the couch cushions because I noticed that they are getting dirty from Daisy, Miss Daisy, who refuses to not go on the couch. We've already done the dog advent calendars. That is why every time we sit on the couch now, they all come running. They think that Molly's gone. They all think that they are getting an advent calendar you know, cookie. Giving them pieces of my uh, popcorn. You're making more mess to clean up. Guess who gets to sweep up the popcorn? Gabby. Gabby gets to. It's Gabby's thing. So in today's advent calendar for the girl Schleich, they got a collar and a leash for their puppies. Super cute. They weren't excited, but I think it's cute. I had something super fun planned for us today, but then when I woke up this morning, God sent me something different to do. So today we might do both, but today we have something completely different planned, something that we haven't been, that we haven't really done. I'm excited. It's something I've been planning to do since the summer. So I'm going to bring you guys along with us and tell you guys what we're going to do. So tomorrow is the day that the farrier arrives. The farrier comes tomorrow. Both farms, the whole farrier experience is a big experience on the day-by-day -day farm because we have six horses. So it takes a while, it takes a lot, and we always have to sit down here and sometimes it's so cold. This is where we end up. We end up sitting on this tack trunk, all of us. Um, I know what we can do. What? Well, next year, after we're done working, you can tack up Penny and Nick can ride Penny. I would love that, but I don't want to put, I don't want Penny, Nick to ride Why Penny. Why is your foot like that? Who's? Bent in yours. My foot's bent in? Yeah, come look at this footprint. Oh my goodness. Just when I try and tell you guys stuff, I get so... Oh, that That's is... yours. <gasps> That's my That's footprint. Sophie. Sophie has bent in feet. Sophia, step there. Step there, Sophie. <gasps> that is you. Yeah, I could tell Sophie. Sophie has different <laughs> bottoms on her shoes. Oh, gosh, you scared me. Um, yeah, I do not have bent in feet. Sophie does. Might be want to go in like that because Brandon made me do it while riding one day. Yeah, it's all Brandon's fault. It's all Brandon's fault. Okay. So, never done that before. so uh, back to what we're doing today. People are always saying, Laura, clean up your tech room. It is a disgusting mess. It's not that bad. You guys know how it is. It's a room that you use all the time, but you don't really spend that much time in here. It's like a drop and go kind of a room. But today is going to be different. Today. I'm hoping to make a living room in our barn, a place that we can rest and oh, and relax when the farrier is here, a place that friends can come and sit, maybe a place that we can shoot more videos. So that's what we're doing today. Oh, if we're going to shoot videos there, then we need a heater. Hey sister, I got you covered. We are going to have a heater. We are going to have blankets. We're going to have a couch. We're going to have a carpet. We are making a living room in this area of the barn right here. Oh. Yeah, and you can even charge your phone because we have a whole wall of plugs over here. And then I just put my cord into that. Yeah. We're going to get started at my um, youngest son, Nick. Nicholas, you guys, a lot of you guys know him. He He's is coming. You said send me candy a lot. Yeah, you guys, a lot of you guys know him. He's grown up. He's married. He has two children. He is coming and he's going to help me and he's going to help us get this done and we're going to try and get it done today.
Okay, so we are getting there. We're getting closer. Girls. The, gr <laughs> the girls have been on a very important uh, mission to see if we can get heat, and we do. We have a heat source. We have oh, a little wood stove. Yeah, that's so fun. So I'm going to just do a little yeah. sweep here. All right, Nick is here, he's just arrived. We're gonna go to the next stage of really? making a living room. Yeah, that is Gabby, but Nick is here too. Okay, like so, no, you do not look like a guy. He just pulled in. So we are going to set up, see, we cleaned it all out, got it all ready. We're gonna set this area up now as a little living room in our barn. My brother's here for the first time in like 10 years. No, he's here for the first time since like July. Well, hello, Penny Pickle. Are you bored? Did you figure out that I'm here? You got. Penny, and then you got Willow, and then you got Gracie. Oh, Penny. I wish you was a happier horse. I wish you were a happier girl. Ollie's right there with Lexi. And every time you swing your arm fast in front of her, she feels nervous, so. Um, look at Ollie and Lexi. And the cats are here. Everybody's here. Everybody's excited to see Nick. In fact, Penny, you've never met Nick before. Oh, wait, I'm going in. I'm going in. Wait, I have to tell you guys something about Penny. This morning, I walked into her stall and there was no goo in her eye and her whole side was clean. She was gorgeous. And I was like, Penny! And then I'm like, what, did you not sleep? And then we turned to this side. I looked at this side and her eye was all gooey on this side. And so allergic to shaving. She's allowed. The shavings get in her eyes and irritate them. I don't know necessarily if she's allergic to them because she doesn't get hives or anything. Yeah, I'm going to figure out something for her. She's like, stop talking about me. See those ears? Oh, I think she's pinning oh, her ears because the horse is behind her. And I feel so bad for taking him. Because, like, what if they have plans and they're going to play? And I feel so bad for taking him. I just take him. Yeah, I think I've created a monster. She's like me, but worse. <laughs> but I feel bad for taking him. He will find were, her. He will find what her. What if they were going to play? Who cares? I don't think they care. I think he's just happy. They have all day. They have all day. That's all they have. I'm going to call them to yeah. come back inside. Anyways, yeah, so now that doesn't, yeah, now I understand myself a little bit more, like, that's exactly what I was like as a child. So the only thing she does bad is get excited when she sees people. Other than that, she's a perfect dog. Hey. Good girl. Uh-uh. Jill. Yeah, this is the only times. thing, if you ignore her, it goes much better. All right, so Nick is here, and he's going to meet my horse for the very first time. Back it up, sister. I'm going to go get She doesn't love, here, have some treats. She doesn't love men. I'm well, go I don't love men either. <laughs> I'm go but you could one. love men if you wanted to. Is this the new one? What's this one? That's the new one. <laughs> yeah, these are the ones that you've seen all summer. Penny, just put your hand out and say, here, Penny. Oh, hello, Penny, Penny Pickle. She likes anybody who's kind. Hello. She hates Gabby. Dogs like me, so she'll probably like <laughs> <laughs> Are you laughing about the Gabby? Yeah. <laughs> No, I'm not joking. See those ears? That's her. She's just a grouchy mare. Like, mares are grouchy. Here, here I miss is. Sabrina. I miss Sabrina, too. Here. What about Stella? She's a user. She'll take you for your... What one's Stella? Is she the... She looked exactly she... like her. The... One yeah. that died. <laughs> yeah, so this is Penny, and she's amazing. She just has... Her bark is worse than her bite. That's a girl. Don't let her... Yeah. She doesn't bite, but I mean. Gracie likes people. And here's Gracie. She'd be loving everybody who walks in the door. She's like, he's my boy. I love, she loves boys. <laughs> really? I've never had a good experience. Ah! <laughs> Penny, be nice. Be friendly. She's like friendly enough to take your food, but then after that, you're screwed. Watch out, Nick, because when they get close together, Gracie could whack you with her bum on the way running out. Probably move, Gracie. Probably. All right. <laughs> Chill. All right, don't put your back towards me. <laughs> don't worry, she won't bite you. Well, All right, come on, I'll show you what we got going on. So this is our area. We're gonna put a big sectional here, a carpet, and a fireplace. Okay. What do you think? And we're gonna put a blanket under that door. Under this door right here? Yeah. I have plastic. I have those rubber things. I can set that. I set that up, or I can pull that yellow thing and over in front fireplace. of it. Yeah, that's the fireplace. 
But if we hurry, we can make it look nice. The hard work is already done. We'll move it closer. It looks like it is not warm enough. All right, so the plan is to bring this couch into the barn and knock all the snow off of it. We even have a coffee table. All right, let's do it. All right, we are getting there. We are getting there. This is another corner piece. So it's got to go right here. Let's maybe put one more piece there. Or do you want to make it like an L shape? Oh, that's fine. Just wait till another piece comes in there. We're going to dry off the couch and then put the cushions on. I even have loungers. Right, we've got it going on. We're just waiting on Gabby. We sent the we sent the slowest person to the house. Uh oh, she's back. You Whoa. can tell she's back because the dog is back. All right, Gabby is back. Okay, go get all the cushions. Do the sides there too, Nick. This is why we had help so that he could do all the work. He did actually all the hard work. He brought all the pieces to the gate and we just had to bring them in. Almost like I'm at work. Yeah, almost like you're at work right now. All right, Nick is gone. Keep in mind that we still have a lot of stuff in our barn and it's always going to have like a little bit of a mess to it, um, especially in the winter. But anyway, this is it. This is our new living room area. Keep in mind also that we moved the furniture in when it was all gross and gooey outside. So it's kind of dirty. All of our outdoor furniture covers for the cushions need to be washed this year. But dun da da da. This is our new barn area. What do you guys think? Sophie likes it. The heater thing is still on. I didn't. I turned it off. He turned it off. All right. So this is it. This is our barn. It now has a living room with blankets on each corner, pillows, a coffee table. My butt's all wet. Yeah. And it's freezing off. So this is another view of our new living room in the barn. We also have a fireplace over there, if you guys can see. It doesn't put out a ton of heat. It puts out heat, but I mean, the whole room is big. If they put like, if we put like, I don't know, if we made this into just a small room, it would probably hold heat a little bit better, but it's not insulated, so it wouldn't even hold heat. So this is it. This is our living room. This is where we're going to hang out tomorrow when the farrier is here. I have an idea. What? So, you know those curtain thingies? Yeah. You put them around so that the heat gets trapped in when you put yeah. the fireplace on. Yeah. That's a good idea. I have some curtains, some wooden curtains that we could hang up here. Twerk, twerk, but anyways. Okay, Sophie. Twerk, It's called twerk, not turk. <laughs> twerk. If you can't um, say it, you can't do it. Twerk, 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 twerk. All right. All right. It's time for us to go up to the house. Have lunch. Okay, stop with the twerking. Stop. This is it. This is our new setup. I wanted to show you guys. I know a lot of you guys have been wanting us to clean the barn. And we did it, kind of. What my kids all don't know is that I wanted these, uh, the furniture in for the winter, not left in the back. And so this was yeah, just an excuse to that. get it put in. Yeah, you can see. Liar. Yeah, I know. All right, let's go eat. Let's go eat, puppies. I, I, I had just pulled the meat out of the fridge for supper, and you guys will never believe what is on the back. It's a heart, a heart. It's on a the, bloody heart. It is a bloody heart, but it's still a heart. The girls are playing Star Stable. You playing Star Stable? Playing Star Stable. It's one of those afternoons where it's kind of dark and dreary and there's not much to do. I would be watching my girl out the window and she's begging me to come down there and ride her. But the ground is soaked and wet and muddy. So it is not a penny day. But tomorrow is a penny day. I am making us some pasta for supper. I'm using my friend's deer. My friend hunts and he gave me some venison. He gave me some ground venison and it tastes amazing and we're making pasta with it. Also having a Caesar salad which is one of our which is one of my girls favorites. All the love! Uh -huh. oh, oh. oh you lost the puppy! Come on. Good girl. They're all excited. They are all excited. Back when I was younger and he would go to work, I would like rearrange all the furniture. I would do so much changing in the house and he would come home and he would always be mad. He'd be like, ah, oh, why are you changing stuff? He does not like change. And so I wanted to surprise him with the whole new barn renovation. And by renovation, obviously, I mean like decorating. But yeah, so I'm coming down here. He's coming down to help me put the horses in for the night. And we're going to see how he likes what we did with the barn. All right, I think he drove down here. Oh. 
<laughs> what do you mean what the heck? This is for us to have a sitting spot. Like when you're down in the bar now and you have to like wait for the farrier and yeah. all that stuff. Don't you love it? No, it's all messy. How's it messy? I mean, it's kind of messy because there's not much room in here. I love it. I told them already that you were going to hate it because you always hate everything first. But let's see who's the first person to be sitting Why? there. Don't you know that you're beautiful?